If you need some coins to add some ballers to your team, make sure you go ahead and check out MudReserve.com. Fast service, great rates, no need to rely on pack luck. Get yourself some coins, buy the players you want, use code SPREE at checkout for 15% off. What's going on everybody? Hope you're all having another fantastic day today. You can call me Spree and welcome back to another video. Today is a good day. We have football. Shout out to all you guys. I hope your teams ball out. Unless of course you're a Raiders fan. Now today I wanted to go ahead and drop my defensive scheme. We've been working on it in the background. It is quite a long video. There's a lot of parts to it. So it is going to take me a little longer to do. So today we're going to jump into a bit of a pack opening. I have seen people pulling absolute heat from get a gold player packs. Now I've had bad luck with them throughout the years. They haven't been very good for me. But today we're going to I change that there are some good LTDs in packs there are a ton of cards with good value let's see if we can open up a ton maybe 50 maybe 60 maybe even a hundred who knows we're gonna see if we can pull some heat let's get glitchy let's make a ton of coins as always before we get into it if you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the content if you do like these pack openings definitely consider popping down hitting that subscribe button down below but uh let's get into it Let's go try and make a ton of coins. Now, like I talked about a few weeks ago, we do want to be doing all of the pack openings from the No Money Spent account. It's not the best use of my coins, that's for sure. But I do want to have some fun with it. I do want to try and be great. I do want to pull some of these new limited time cards that are dropping every day, every couple of days. So we are going to try our luck today. If we have a look at these Get A Gold Player packs and we have a look at the odds, they're pretty good at the moment. Almost a 20% chance of pulling an 81 plus. So I'd say we should be pulling a decent amount of elites overall, though we want the high overall pulls let's see some 50 players let's see some reduxes let's see an ltd let's just go out there let's have some fun let me go and quickly pick up a bunch of these i'll be back with you in a second a few moments later 50 get a gold players i think that's going to be more than enough to get us started if we start pulling a bit of heat we'll open up more packs if we pull absolute trash We'll probably open more packs as well. I do want to see if we can pull some good players. I want to see the hate that everyone else has been getting. Let's jump on into them. The very first pack. Do we have first pack heat today? Jumping on in, we don't even get an elite. Starting off with a 79. Now, more than likely, we're probably going to skip through a ton of these. I'm not expecting a lot of really good pulls. There's our first elite and our second pack. But all I'm hoping is I don't lose too many coins. We want to try get a bunch of decent pulls right there. We have an 83. Down in the comment section below, I want you guys to let me know how your packs have been lately. If you've been opening get a player packs, trying to pull power ups. If you've been opening get a gold player packs, trying to pull some of these LTD cards, we get ourselves a power up. That is Arian Foster. If you've been jumping into the bundles and you've been pulling the legend packs the 50 packs let me know what kind of heat you guys have been pulling almost 10 packs through we do have a couple of elites we do have a darren waller right there i would have liked his redux but uh we'll take elites another elite we'll take a patrick peterson this man is definitely due a new card might have to look at his power up he might be worth investing in at the moment we're already about a third of the way through our packs and we haven't pulled very much at all a couple of lower elites We've definitely lost coins so far, but we are waiting for that big boy pull. An 86 plus, even, even an 86 will at least get us back in the right direction. So hopefully, hopefully we can actually see something. I do want a big boy pull, and that gold is not going to be it. We get a team of the week. An 82, it's been a little bit of a dry run. We will take an elite right there. We're halfway through our first 50 packs. This is the first card we picked up. Overall though, not looking too good so far. Nothing of really good value. I think this 82 team of the week card going for around 14, 15K. That's our best pull so far. Let's dive back into it. Let's see if we can start heating up a little bit. We don't want 79s. We don't want golds. We don't want rookies. We don't even really want power-ups. I want to see elite right there. Can we get something in 87 Jack Youngblood? That is more like what we want to see. Now, I know some people out there are going to be the Pack Kings. Right here, we get ourselves an 83. We want to see some more animations like that. I know some people out there are the Pack Kings. Some people are Redux Kings. Some people are pulling a lot of heat. I reckon I change my title. I reckon I just become the gold pulling king because all we're pulling right here is gold. We're not pulling cards of really good value. We are just getting a lot of those low overall gold. So, uh... Yeah, maybe the get a gold king, just straight up getting gold. Maybe that's going to have to be my title. We already have less than 10 packs remaining. Right here, we get a 78. That's not what we want to see. We want to see the big boy cards. I want to at least see some fun animations. Let me see something we haven't seen so far. No worry, I've seen plenty of those. We get ourselves some lights right there. Can we get something in 88 Lawrence Taylor? 
Definitely not as crazy as what it used to be, but I will take it. That is definitely our best fall so far. We get ourselves a 50 player, a 91 Vincent Jackson. Let's go, baby. Starting to heat up towards the end. More packs remaining from this first 50. We get ourselves a 72. And with this final pack, can we get a little bit of hate? We have gotten a little bit of luck after these last few pulls. Getting off right here, we get a 73. After a really bad start, we did get this Vincent Jackson. What's he going for at the moment? A cool 125K. LT at the moment is looking maybe 30? About 45K, pretty dang good right there. Because of those two cards, we went from losing a ton of coins to being able to make a little bit of profit. We're gonna be able to sell those, sell some of our elites, build up some of those golds, and we're gonna be able to make at least our coins back, but I suspect we'll be able to make a bit of profit. So first 50 packs, most of it dry, but we were able to pull a little bit of heat. I reckon we jump into some more. Let's see if we can be even better. Let's see if we can get higher than a 91 overall. More moments later. Another 50 getter gold players have been purchased. I think, boys, they might have trapped me. They gave me a little bit of heat towards the end. They got me spending up my coins. They got me opening up packs. Well, let's see. Can we find a window? Can we go ahead and pull some heat with the second bunch? I'll probably skip through a ton of these as well. Let's just hope we can get something good. Oh, we get a most feared. All right, we'll take an 83. An 82, not bad. Back-to-back -back elites right there. We get ourselves an 80. That is back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back elites. Let's keep it rolling. Let's get ourselves a fourth elite in a row. Oh, we get ourselves a legend piece right there in 84. We get ourselves another legend piece right there in 88. We seem to be heating up a little bit. A lot more elites in this next batch of packs. Now, as always, I don't really suggest going ahead and opening up packs with coins. It's not the best value. There are much better ways to spend those coins, upgrade your team. But as I like to say, you have to risk it for the biscuit. If you want to try pull some of these LTD cards, you do definitely need to spend some coins. So that's what we're trying to do today. We want to be great. Not pulling Garrett Bradbury's is going to help, but uh, better than a gold, I suppose. Oh, we get ourselves another 50 player, a 91 Derek Brooks. Let's go, baby. Probably two of the worst ones you can pull, but we're making a ton of profit right now. Right now, it feels like we've been pulling a little bit of heat. We get ourselves an 82 right there. All right, we're a little bit over halfway now through the second bunch of packs, and we've made a good amount of profit so far. I do want to say, though, if we do go cold in this last set of packs, we're probably going to end up around the same value as our first set. So we're probably going to be able to make profit at this stage. But we're going to be hopeful that we can pull some more heat. Something better than these elites, though. That is what we're looking for. We get ourselves a team of the week right there. That's an 83. We get ourselves another power up. That one is Elvis Doomable. And legend piece. Can we get anything crazy in 85 right there? Can we get a Chad Ochosenko? Can we get an absolute stud that we can add to our team? Five packs remaining. We get ourselves a gold. Next pack up. Can we get something different? No, we get another gold. Third to last pack can we get something uh nope two packs remaining come on let me at least see an elite we get another gold one final pack remaining this is going to be our walk-off pack can we pull something good in this final pack right here expecting a gold we have been on a bit of a run right here we get ourselves a 76 from that second batch of packs obviously it's going to be the Derek brooks that is going to give us a ton of value back going for around 120k our second best pull from those second set of packs is going to be this ricky jackson what's he going for at the moment probably 40k yeah around 40k those top four pulls alone paid for about two thirds of the packs the rest of the cards we're going to be able to sell make our coins back probably make a little bit of profit let's go ahead let's open up a few stragglers we want to make sure we're finishing on an elite even if it's a base overall elite which this is going to be an 80 overall we've got to make sure we're not finishing on gold to get us started in the right place for our next get a gold player pack opening nothing too crazy in that pack opening i was super excited to be able to see some of those 50 players i haven't really pulled any of those this year so that was good to see that animation and good to see some of those high overall cards i do like these get a gold player packs man they are pretty dang good you're getting some pretty good value out of them at the moment so maybe we're gonna have to start doing these a little bit more regularly what do you guys think do you want to see more of these get a gold player pack openings but yeah that is gonna be it for today folks thank you very much for coming through i hope you enjoyed the pack opening opening i hope you're enjoying football and i hope your team balls out unless you guys are the raiders thank you very much for coming through take it easy everyone you can call me spree and we out